more than a month of voting, 57 areas in seven states and one union territory will vote in the final phase of Lok Sabha elections on Saturday. Voting will happen in 13 seats in Uttar Pradesh, 9 in West Bengal, 8 in Bihar, 6 in Odisha, 3 seats in Jharkhand, 1 seat in Chandigarh, all 13 areas in Punjab, 4 seats in Himachal Pradesh. There are 904 candidates running in the last phase. Now, some of the well-known candidates are Prime Minister Narendra Modi, Abhishek Banerjee, Ravi Shankar Prasad, Kangra Nanod, and Anurag Thakur. The counting of votes for all 543 Lok Sabha seats will take place on June 4. Now, in this video, let's talk about the key battle in this phase of Lok Sabha elections. First, the craziest battle we all were waiting for is Narendra Modi versus Ajay Rai in Varanasi. Prime Minister Narendra Modi is trying to win for the third time in a row from Varanasi in Uttar Pradesh. He is running against Ajay Rai from the Indian National Congress, who also ran against him in the last two elections. Now, the Bahujan Samaj Party has put forward Sayyid Ali as their candidate for this important seat. The second battle is between Rekha Patra and Haji Nurul Islam, and this battle is in Basirhat. In West Bengal's Basirhat seat, there is an intense election contest. The All India Trinamool Congress has chosen Haji Islam as their candidate, replacing Nushal Jahan, who faced a lot of criticism for her work as an MP. On the other hand, BJP has chosen Rekha Patra as their candidate. She is also known for her role in the protest in Sandesh Kali against the now arrested TMC leader Sheikh Shah Jahan and his associates. The third battle is between Sudeep Bandopadhyay versus Tapas Roy in Kolkata North. Now in Kolkata North, there is a major election battle between the current TMC Bandopadhyay and BJP's Tapas Roy. Prime Minister Narendra Modi held a road show in part of this constituency on Tuesday. Now the very next day, West Bengal Chief Minister Mamta Banerji led a march along the same route. Dabas Roy, who used to be a TMC MLA, joined the BJP before the elections. The Congress has chosen Pratib Bhattacharya as their candidate with support from the left front. Misa Bharti vs Ram Kripal Yadav is the fourth major battle. In the Patali Putra constituency in Bihar, Misa Bharti, the daughter of Rashtriya Jananta Dal chief Lalu Prasad Yadav, is competing against current BJP MP Ram Kripal Yadav. Misa Bharti lost to Ram Kripal Yadav in both 2014 and 2019 elections. Here let me tell you that in 2009, Lalu Prasad Yadav also lost the seat to Rajan Yadav. Now here let me tell you that in 2009, Lalu Prasad Yadav also lost this seat to Rajan Yadav, a former aide who ran as a Jananta Dal United candidate. Now the fifth battle is between Kangana Ranaut and Vikramaditya Singh. Bollywood actor and BJP candidate Kangra Nanoth is running for the very first time in the elections from Mandi, Himachal Pradesh, which is, by the way, a strong area for the Congress. Kangana, who is from Himachal Pradesh, also compete against experienced Congress MP Vikramaditya Singh. Mandi is a stronghold for the Singh family, and the seat is currently held by Vikram Aditya's mother, Pratibha Singh. The next battle is between Anurag Thakur and Satpal Singh Raizada. Well, Union Minister Anurag Thakur is trying to win for the fourth term as MP from Hamirpur in Himachal Pradesh. He is running against Congress candidate Satpal Singh Raizada. Thakur first became MP from Hamirpur in 2008 after his father resigned and he since won the elections in 2009, 14 and 19 from the same seat. Now, the seventh battle is between Sanjay Tandon and Manish Tiwari. Chandigarh, known for its changing party control often, will see a big contest between the BJP's Sanjay Tandon and Congress candidate Manish Tiwari. Tandon, who has been a municipal councillor in Punjab for 14 years, is replacing actor-turned-politician Kiran Kher for this seat. Tiwari, currently an MP from Anandapur Sahab in Punjab, is aiming for an important win in Chandigarh. Now, last but not the least, in Gorakhpur battle is between Ravi Kishan and Kajal Nishal. 
Now in Gorakhpur, which is a strong area for BJP and key place for Uttar Pradesh Chief Minister Yogi Adityanath, there will be face-off between two actors turned politician. The BJP's Ravi Kishan and Samajwadi Party's Kajal Nishal, both famous in the Bhojpuri film industry, are competing against each other. In the 2019 elections, Kiran defeated SP candidate Ram Bhuan Nishad with more than 60% of the seat. So these all are the key battles that we all were expecting in 7th phase of Lok Sabha elections. Now who will dominate who? Only time will tell. But till then, do follow India.com for more such updates.